Hey, what's up? Hello, y'all. It's your girl, Evolving Goddess. Welcome to my channel, y'all. So if you guys are new for the first time, welcome. If you have been rocking with me, though, you already know what time it is. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. So what's up, Leos? My lovely Leos. What's going on with you guys, all right? So your start off song, right? This is the love reading, guys, for the month of September. Only take what resonates. Don't force it if it's not your story. Also, guys, the roles can be reversed here. We're talking about energy, guys, okay? So we got um, Lotus Flower, I think the name of this song is, by Wale, right? So um, this could be you. This is how you're feeling. This is how your person feeling here. Um, I was drawn to the title Ambition, or I think it was Ambitious, okay? So somebody is very ambitious here. And look, we have this Emperor. So Divine Masculine Energy or just a true boss. Somebody's older, all right? Yeah, somebody's chasing their dreams. Somebody wants their dreams to come true here, okay? Stepping in their power, guys, going after something that they are really passionate about or trying to take back their power, right? No longer in a fantasy. Look, <laughs> somebody wants their fantasy to come into reality here, okay? <laughs> you need to be my lady, right? Okay, y'all. Uh, all right, so what's going on, you guys? Look, proposals, love offers, you guys are chasing the dream here. You're thinking about something really tough, trying to be strategic, guys. You guys are planning your move. And I kind of felt that here. I felt like planning your move. That's exactly what I felt here. Somebody speaking some truth here. All right, wanting to kind of put an end to something that was devastating, to something that was stressing them out. Somebody could definitely be daydreaming, fantasizing about somebody. Hey, I want to bring you some love potentially here. Maybe somebody younger, or maybe it's a water sign. Um, it's just, you know, a, a fantasy, guys, right? Something that you're really passionate about, guys. All right, so this could be you, it could be somebody bringing it to you, though, Leo. Okay, all right, let's see. Lots of planning going on for you guys. Okay, guys, lotus flower, right? Beautiful. All right, Leo, what's going on with y'all? Love life. <laughs> all right, guys, Ooh, tower. So, some changes, right? Life changes happen. Um, yeah, you guys might be feeling a little bit alone here. Or maybe you guys had to go within to kind of figure out how you could change your life around here, okay? So this is maybe no contact or people just really kind of retreating from the rest of the world because, hey, I have to make some changes or something in my life changed and it made me kind of go within. It made me kind of figure out, okay, why would, that didn't cut good, guys. You guys are waiting, planning something. I got to recut it, guys, because it wasn't a clean cut. It wasn't clean, so I got to do whatever. All right. So maybe it's a redo here, right? Something ended and it was messy. And you guys are getting a redo potentially here. A second chance. All right, let's see. <laughs> yeah. All right, so somebody walked away from somebody here, okay? Um, but somebody wants something solid here, right? Maybe somebody walked away from a marriage. Maybe somebody just walked away in the past, potentially. Um, but they had to walk away because maybe things were just a little bit rocky here, right? We couldn't get it right. There was maybe some toxicity, some codependency. Maybe somebody was too much involved in work. There was some kind of distraction here in the connection. Maybe drinking, maybe drugs. Maybe it was just all about sex, right? But I feel like now people are wanting something deep here. They're wanting something solid. Right, that tower card, that's what happened. There was a sudden change here, okay? Something that wasn't built on a solid foundation. I want to show you how much. Okay, you guys got Beyonce playing right now. Something wasn't fair here, right? Something happened. Somebody got hurt, right? Somebody walked away. This is my ego card. People really not seeing eye to eye. There were just some differences. Somebody was left out in the cold here. Tonight I wanted, I think you guys had this song on, on the general reading. But it's like, tonight I want to dance for you. Okay. All right. All right. So, all right, y'all. So, the emperor, divine masculine energy here, a true boss. Somebody who knows what it is that they want and they get it here. All right. Somebody's trying to listen to their intuition, right? They're really trying to figure out, hey, you know, I don't want to be confused. I really want to take charge of my life here. Maybe this is somebody coming in for you. Or like I said, you could be kind of chasing a dream potentially here. All right. Yeah, taking charge here. Um, but guys, the, a true divine masculine has that perfect balance here. Okay, both the divine masculine and divine feminine. But this person has been through some things in their life here. And that's how they became the boss here, okay? So somebody has something on the mind. Let's find out. Maybe this is coming in or maybe you're chasing after somebody. Or this is just you trying to step back into your power. So what's your focus, y'all? Ooh, the queen of swords, right? So for some of you guys, it's somebody, right? 
because somebody walked away here. So somebody got cut out, right? Somebody was blocked here. Um, this was just, you know, somebody was maybe being a little bit cold here. You guys might... <laughs> All right, so some of you guys may like that here. You might you might have this person in mind here, right? This person has changed. This person has transformed. This person is a go-getter. This person is strong here, all right? She kind of goes, she's been through a lot here too, right? But even after the storm here, I'm still true. I'm still authentic. I'm still beautiful here, right? I'm going to go with the flow. It's just you can't pull the wool over my eye anymore here. I'm going to cut you right out, all right? So for some of you guys, that you guys really trying to embrace both of these, right? You guys are maybe trying trying to recover from something here. I'm trying to find that balance in my life. I'm cutting out people, places, things, behaviors here, okay? Maybe I'm just gonna try to be with my boo thing. Potentially, this is a couple, guys, all right? Otherwise, it's you guys here. So either you are trying to embody this energy or this is somebody that you have on your mind here, okay? All right, so let's see. Three cards surrounding you here. Yeah, six of swords. You guys are trying to either move towards this person or you're trying to move on here, right? Drop in the pain, drop in the confusion. I'm trying to travel to you, I'm trying to relocate here. I'm trying to look forward to better days here. I want to move in a new direction. All right, guys, there could have been some deception in the past. The six and this one sword, guys, there was some deception in the past or maybe even self-sabotage here, right? That's what got cut out. Right, somebody got cut off or somebody cut out old ways about themselves here, okay? All right, yeah, five of pentacles. Somebody was left out in the cold here, all right? Somebody may be juggling finances. This Somebody felt like I didn't have any support here, right? So either this is you or that person, right? But this is somebody who was, less, you know, maybe... They just didn't have, they didn't have anybody. They were feeling lonely here, okay? So it was like either somebody cut you out, Leo, or you cut somebody out, right? So you guys are trying to move past that here, okay? Somebody's wanting that support. I want to open, I want to be open to receive support. I don't want to be so hard and so, so, um, what is the word? I, the word, the word, I lost the word, guys, okay? bitter i don't want to be so hard and so bitter that i'm not acting as if i don't need support guys okay because this real right here this is somebody who is just really strong here i'm a boss i could take on the weight of the world here right i'm feeling a little bit lonely i'm feeling a little bit cut off here um you know i lost everything and it's just like i'm still not even kind of reaching out for support type energy guys okay what else Ten of Pentacles, right? You want a family, guys. All right, you guys want your family. You want your stability here. You want something for the long term. All right, so maybe this is... Yeah, I feel like this is you guys are seeing somebody like that. Um, there was some kind of break, some kind of disconnect, right? Somebody walked away, and but it's like you guys are wanting that ten of pentacles you may be wanting this person like you want to make a move towards this person all right i want a family i want stability guys there's a lot of women here okay i know there's a lot of women in this deck here anyway but i'm just saying like this person right here it's like they were going through some difficult times but now here right they're sitting really pretty. They're really stable. They're really strong, this person here. Okay, so either you're looking at somebody like they're very strong or this is you really trying to be strong on your own and you may need to kind of reach out for support or just allow somebody to kind of let you in here. All right, but yeah, you guys are wanting stability. I want that commitment. I want something for the long term here. Yeah, I'm drawn to this deer, right? Being gentle. All right, you guys want to... You guys want to take a gentle approach to maybe approaching this person or there's a need for you guys to be gentle here, okay? Very, it's like something about this is complicated because it's like this reading is kind of complicated here. This is very complex here, this reading, okay? But yeah, otherwise somebody wanted some kind of commitment and it got cut here. All right, so what's in your recent past, guys? A broken family? Something about a broken family here. Somebody's family got cut out here, okay? All right. All right, so what's in the recent past for you guys here? Page of Cups here. Um, so, you know, okay, so somebody maybe kind of heard some news possibly about a baby. 
all right um, otherwise guys this is somebody who is really trying um, there could have been somebody that was a little bit immature or emotionally not available there we go in the past right somebody wasn't emotionally available or somebody's trying to heal trying to pour into their cup here okay page of cups this is maybe trying to be innocent again here trying to be open to love again trying to bring a new excitement in the love department here okay I want to move to better days here all right I want to cut out whatever past behaviors that had me kind of cut you know, that have me or somebody feeling left out in the cold. I want to take charge. I want to be a provider, okay? You guys are maybe wanting to kind of be a, be there for somebody, right? Or you're wanting somebody to be there for you guys, okay? All right, so what is it that you guys are wanting? To speak some kind of truth here, all right, guys? You guys are wanting to speak some truth. All these swords, guys, we got the six and then two swords. That's the eight of swords. So some of you guys are maybe kind of feeling a little bit stuck, not expressing yourself, maybe kind of not communicating something. You're feeling a little bit trapped. It could be all in your head. It could be in the physical here, too. But you guys are wanting to kind of speak some kind of truth here. Maybe you're wanting an apology, all right? You guys are just wanting a new beginning. You guys want to overcome these obstacles here. Okay, I want to overcome the old ways. I want to overcome people maybe that were kind of deceiving me or I just really want to speak some truth here to somebody. Okay, I want some kind of communication. Yeah, drink away the tears, drink away the pain here. All right, some of you guys are really feeling a little bit like you don't have the support or you guys don't have, you guys are feeling a little bit left out here like you don't have family. It's a lot of single women in here, okay? This could be a woman that has children. You could be the woman here you're looking for, like you're looking for that divine masculine energy or there's a need for you to kind of embrace a divine feminine energy if you're just all divine masculine, okay, guys? This is deep. All right, so what is it that you guys fear, though? Yeah, some of you guys want to apologize, though. All right, what is it that you guys fear? All right, so you guys fear either, <laughs> see, Okay, guys, so some of you guys, it's your it's your own self here, right? This is your card, Leo, right? This is the strength card here, all right? It's like, you know what? I don't want to be vulnerable because I am the strength. I am a divine masculine. I am the Leo. I make things happen. I get what I want here, okay? Um, but this is a different type of strength, guys. This is being gentle, right? This is what I'm saying. I was drawn to that deer. This is being gentle. This is being, you know, compassionate. This is being soft. This is using that inner strength to be able to show a different side of you here okay maybe it's showing somebody support that needs the support or maybe it's allowing the support in here this is people kind of working together not having the ego right not just going all hardcore at this is you know what i gotta be a little bit gentle here okay this is that balance between the divine masculine and divine feminine guys there's no person that can handle a lion here maybe your fear and your weakness is somebody that there's only maybe one person that can kind of handle you the way that you deserve or the way that you need to be handled, okay? Because this is a special somebody that could tame a lion here, right? And that's you, right? This is a special somebody that can kind of tame you here, all right? So maybe your weakness is just really kind of showing that weaker side or kind of going after that person that makes you feel that way here, okay, guys? All right, yeah, because she's looking away this ace of swords. It's like, I want to communicate some truth. I want to open up here. I want to have, okay, I want to change, I want to change. I want to bring some new love here. I want to be innocent. I want to bring some purity here, okay? But it's like, you know what? Maybe I'm too much of a divine masculine that I can't hear. Deep, guys. All right, or maybe you're feeling this person, whoever got cut off, this person, Blossom, right? This is what I'm saying. Like, this person went through a lot here, but they kind of overcame they, they, they overcame their challenges, right? And maybe you're like, you know what? Maybe it's too late. I want to apologize, but maybe it's too late. This person is so strong here, okay? Possibly, guys. All right, and so that's the reason why some of you guys are like ambitious, like, you know what, I'm going to go after it anyway. So for my people that are doing that, you know, the guidance, well, let's see what the advice is here. What's the advice there? The boomerang here, what goes around comes around here, okay? So this is, you know, you guys are maybe kind of really in a position of like, if this is about your love, right, like how did 
Like, how can I change this? How can I do something different to get something different, right? Because in the past, somebody walked away. Somebody got cut off here, right? Somebody wasn't feeling like their needs were getting met. Financially, physically, they were just feeling a little bit left out here, okay? You guys, there's no love here on the board except for a little bit of love here, all right? This is a page. You guys are coming up as a whole emperor, right? The emperor is the king of all kings. That means I'm the king of cups. I'm the king of pentacles, but I'm the king of cups here. So I know how to express my love here, guys, okay? All right, y'all. All right, and then the recent past is the Page of Cups here, right? Maybe somebody wasn't showing that or somebody is trying to grow up and somebody's trying to evolve, right? When it comes to the emotional department, they're trying to be more expressive with their feelings, guys, okay? Deep. All right, so what's the advice from Spirit? Um, you know, patience. <laughs> this is healing, guys. All right. Um, this is definitely being patient, taking your time, and taking a step back here. Allow the healing to take place. Okay. You guys could be at a distance, maybe physically, mentally, um, or just even emotionally, guys. All right. But there's some kind of there's some kind of healing. All right. Once again, somebody was left out in the cold. A lot of pain here. This person is trying to get insight, trying to get clarity here. Okay. So maybe this is speaking some truth here. Guys, I'm getting apology here for some of you guys or just, you know, really kind of speaking some truth, right? Because there's some kind of truth that you guys are wanting to speak. There's some kind of clarity you guys are wanting. You guys are wanting a realization. You guys are wanting forward movement here. I no longer want to be stuck. All right. So this is maybe kind of speaking the truth. Maybe this is apologizing. Maybe this is kind of healing something. All right. Putting in the work and staying committed for it. The Ten of Pentacles. This is something for the long term. And when we're building something for the long term, it takes work here. OK, so this is really kind of seeing things maybe from all parties perspectives and being patient. All right, not closing your eyes to the truth, guys, okay? Because, like, even in this picture, there's a fantasy, there's a dream, but her eyes are closed, guys, okay? And that's the reason why I feel like somebody kind of walked. You guys, there's a lot of eyes being closed here. This was that Eight of Swords that I saw here, right? So somebody maybe not communicating, not expressing something. Somebody's feeling a little bit stuck. Somebody's feeling a little bit trapped. Somebody's feeling a little bit helpless here, okay? Whether it be you or that person and somebody's trying to walk out of that energy. I'm trying to walk into a higher vibration. I'm trying to walk towards my wishes or try to walk to, towards self-care, guys. All right? Deep, guys. All right, what else here? strength card your weakness your challenge is you maybe the challenge is you kind of really being who you are staying true to who you are guys right yeah staying true to who you guys are that might be a challenge all right being optimistic guys all right maybe the challenge is being le uh, being loyal the strength card guys is all about loyalty all right having the strength Maybe the challenge is just being strong here, right? Some of you guys are feeling like you're, you know, you're not strong, right? I can't do it. I can't move forward. There's some kind of healing that needs to maybe kind of take place. Something about your family potentially here, right? You guys are trying to heal, all right? Some of you guys are just wanting some kind of communication, all right? From somebody where you were feeling a little bit left out. All right, guys. All right, so what other messages do we have, please, Sarah? Yeah, something about a woman, guys. There's a lot of women here, all right? There's a lot of women, like somebody is something, this person means a lot to you. All right, guys, learning, right? Learning, growing, forgiveness here. Um, trying to be open-minded, learning from past experiences, right? People either have to work together or build together, build something on a solid foundation, forgiving and learning from the past, all right? Pay attention to the red flags here, all right? This is, you know, that boomerang effect, right? I'm not doing the same things because I've already learned something. The queen of, the queen of swords is all about learning from past experiences here, cutting out the things that, you know, weren't for her highest 
good so that she can have her ten of pentacles so that she can have her happily ever after that empire all right guys whoever this person is whether it be you or this person you guys this is like empire type energy especially with the queen guys she's very smart she's very analytical very logical here and because she can turn into her pain into power and that's exactly what she did here she gets anything that she wants the ten of pentacles the family the money the abundance right this is somebody who can be gentle but then also has the heart of a lion right so whether that be you embracing this energy or this person that you're looking at guys this is like um empire type energy here okay all right, um, open up and be vulnerable, okay? Be vulnerable again, Leo. All right, guys? Yeah, see, look, it's complicated. I felt like that. All right, there's a lot of love and a lot of passion, but the situation is complicated here. All right, maybe some challenging times in the relationship, and I see it here, guys, okay? Um, there could be some back and forth, potentially. All right, one or both people are maybe kind of hard to please, guys. There's some strong energy here, right? Sometimes that's not, it's not the easiest here. It's about that balance here, okay? Both people really have an understanding and communicating right really awakening to both people's side of the story all right there's seven of swords there's seven this way and there's seven this way okay so that's either deception guys or it's self-sabotage is people kind of not opening up a little bit guys it's that type of energy it may not be good it may not be bad but deception is still something that's being hidden so i feel like you guys are being asked to go ahead and open up leo guys this is deep all right, um, a tower moment, but it is bringing you a new foundation. Okay, so we saw the tower card. The tower card. You guys are recovering from something here, and you guys are being um, given a second chance. Right, you're being allowed to rebuild on something, be, rebuild on something more solid here. You guys. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Wait a minute. This song. Hold up. You're cold like Minnesota, guys. So some of y'all might be from Minnesota. Oh, shout out to Minnesota. I love y'all. <laughs> All right. But really, guys, really quick. I'm sorry. I know this is... Maybe y'all need to have some more fun, right? Um, there's a lot of cold here. So you talk about your cold like Minnesota, guys. If anybody's from Minnesota, right, hometown, then you guys know it's cold as hell. All right. And there's nothing but cold here. All right. So some of you guys are really kind of cold. You guys got to open up here. Some of you guys are feeling like, you know, I was done so dirty here. Okay. So you're still being asked to go ahead and still be optimistic here. Right. Let whatever happened in the past heal. Because that's what this strength card is looking right at. She's looking right at this four of swords. That means healing. All right. Resting. Taking a step back. Right. Seeing something clearly. Getting an understanding of something. Maybe apologizing or communicating if that's what I got to do. Um, but it's definitely just taking a step back so I can get my mind right here. Okay. All right deep guys this is deep all right thinking about you guys you could be thinking about somebody or somebody's thinking about you guys we're not going to do all these cards because it's a lot we're already at 22 minutes here thinking about you though but somebody's unable to kick the connection here somebody's saying it on somebody's mind i can't ignore these feelings here but are you speaking on them leo right because there's only a little bit of love here all right this is the one that got away um, a new connection, a new energy, high school love type energy. Okay, guys. So there's not really a lot of new love, a lot of new energy in this at all, guys. So I feel like in order for you guys to kind of get to that next level, please allow something from the past to heal so that you can invite some new energy here. Okay. Because the only new energy is this past energy, which is the page of cups. So this could be you trying to self love here, right? Because it's right here. Um, self reflecting. Okay. Getting really deep with yourself. All right. Are you the person that you want to attract? Somebody is feeling a little bit left out in the cold here all right remember relationships marry each other okay somebody has no contact right we see it with that queen of swords got straight cut off here all right um growth this this situation that happened this connection right you guys are growing from this it's, t it's teaching you a lot about yourself here somebody's single all right and somebody who knows what they want now because they are healing or they have healed here right okay lots of healing guys and then um Twin flame. I'm not going to read all these. I'm just going to show you guys, all right? But this is personal healing that's needed in order to kind of kick the connection, guys, um, or in order to move forward. Guys, shenanigans. I got to do this here because there's really not a lot of love here, guys. This is a love reading here, okay? Um, somebody's stuck in repeated cycles. 
game playing, right? The page of cups. That's somebody who's a little bit immature or just not being really honest with self here or being honest in the connection. Um, petty fights and arguments. Somebody's not seeing the bigger picture. That's what the Ace of Swords is. That's in your hopes position. That's what you guys want. Hey, I want to see the bigger picture. I want to communicate. I want to send some kind of truth here, okay? This is only going to work with serious effort here. That's the strength card. That's your energy here, okay? Somebody's maybe kind of not ready to commit with something here full time. All right, this could be us and guys, <laughs> I'm not going to read all these because we're so deep. We're so long here. This could be us. All right, if people stop playing, there's two sides to every story, guys. All right, um, deep connection with people need to open up. There may be some petty arguments here. Open up and talk. Get real, guys. Some of you guys, that's a little bit challenging for you guys to do here, being vulnerable. All right, changes are needed in the connection. All right, there could be some external um, influences here or even internal. And I feel like it has something to do with either finances, guys, your home life, your family, um, your place of residence, maybe moving, traveling, relocating, something like that. It's either mentally or something in your like residential or your earthly realm here. Okay, guys, maybe even something to do with your children. All right. But this is a deep connection here, okay, guys? And that's it, all right? Somebody or something is being hitting. Trust your intuition. We saw that there, all right? Somebody's not expressing their feelings, guys. All right, somebody's trying to be strategic, right, to achieve success. I felt that in the beginning of the reading here. Go towards your happiness and do it with the open heart and mind. And that's exactly what this card is saying here, okay? Get that clarity. Get your mind right here. So that way that ten of pentacles, that happily ever after, that family, whatever it is, that empire, that castle, that person for the long term, guys, whoever it is, whether this be you or that person, guys, she's looking really pretty, really sexy, really independent here, okay? Come to, come to this person correct, right? So y'all can have something for the long term, guys. All right, Leo, that's it, guys. I love you guys. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support, guys. All right, thank you for rocking with me tough, guys, okay? As always, talk to your girl. I'll talk back, y'all. Peace.